Hello colleagues, this is Deary and I'm greeting you after what was supposed to be the January board meeting that actually took place on February 1st. Uh, the board took some significant actions at this meeting and as I always do, I like to share with them, uh, share them with you and here in the video. Uh, first of all, the board awarded uh, the operation and management of the bookstores to Follett Higher Education Group, the largest college uh, store operator in North America. I really want to thank the faculty, the staff, the administrators, the students uh, who served on the committee that reviewed the RFPs to make those recommendations and evaluations. Uh, we have started the transitioning process for those bookstores uh, very uh, quickly. As a matter of fact, they have our started meeting today. And we've had joint meetings between Montgomery College staff and Follett representatives to help understand the process of those employees who are transitioning to Follett employees. So I really, again, want to thank everyone who has been a very challenging and time-consuming process that we have moved to this next milestone. Uh, secondly, uh, the board also adopted the FY17 operating budget, which we'll be submitting to the county executive and the county council uh, within the next week or so. This budget prioritizes several key areas, five that I'll speak to momentarily. One, our commitment to students and our employees, specifically talking about how we will build our infrastructure within the institution to support student success and being good fiscal stewards of the resources that have been invested in us by the county and the state and our students. As such, we've asked the county uh, for $10 million in new money to accomplish our goals. And some of those initiatives that we have requested funding for uh, speak to an expansion of our ACES program, uh, funding for our Achieving the Promise work, and certainly more scholarships for our students. The board also voted uh, to rename the Hercules Pinckney Life Sciences Park to the Pinckney Innovations Complex for Science and Technology at Montgomery College which will better be known as Pick MC. Uh, very excited for this because I think this name uh, honors uh, Dr. Pinckney, who has been such a wonderful member of this college community. As a matter of fact, I got a text from him exp expressing his sincere appreciation and gratitude and support for the name change, uh, but also captures the college's focus on programs like biotechnology, cybersecurity, and engineering. And it brings us the opportunity to merge student success and business success together in a new venture that we will hopefully be one of the first community colleges in the country to do this type of work. Uh, finally, and probably just as important, that allows us to be able to create a conceptual framework for this work, uh, the board voted to approve our 10-year facilities master plan, uh, which is required by MHEC, the Maryland Higher Education Commission, and has already been transmitted to them as a result of Monday's vote. Uh, this is a very important document that talks about how the college anticipates and responds to enrollment growth and changes, building structures, and also our land use. Uh, it was, again, a very eventful evening, always a good opportunity for the board to talk about and hear about the work of the college. But most of all, I thank you for everything you do each and every day to engage us in student success and to make sure that our students meet the goals that they are intending to meet. Thank you so much and be well.